Hello, this is Miss Augustine, and today I'm going to walk you through the process of adding your Bitmoji to our classroom picture and how to make a Bitmoji to start with. So I just picked one of my classroom pages, and I'm going to go to Classwork, and I'm going to find the first assignment. Now, in this assignment, I point out to you that you have to create a Bitmoji first. Bitmojis are made using an app. A free app. So if you don't have the Bitmoji app on your phone currently, you have to download the app. And then within that app, you create your avatar. So make it look like you. And then the next thing you have to do, part two, is in order to add it to our documents, you have to download the Google extension. And that's on the Chrome Store. So how do you go to the Chrome Store? So for instance, here, I'm going to click on this little puzzle piece thingy, click on the Web Store, and I'm going to type in Bitmoji and click on it. Now, it's an extension, so notice it's extensions, and I already have it, so I don't have to add it. I've already added it, but you would have to add it to Chrome. So now what you'll do is you can go and look at, for instance, here, this is the assignment. So what I'm going to do is I've added the Bitmoji extension, so I'm going to click on my extensions, scroll to Bitmoji, and that opens up my Bitmoji that I've created somewhere else. So then, for instance, um, you can type in, for instance, pose or whatever, um, or you can type in school. And let's say I like this one of me looking like I'm ready for questions. How about that one? So you're going to click on the image and say copy image. Then you can come over here to the document that I've created for you and control V and there it is. And you can resize it and then you can answer questions. Now I can take that same Bitmoji and again control V it and then go into this assignment and this is the class picture and I can paste it in. And I would then resize myself to be small, maybe not that small, a little bigger. And there you have it, and I'll be on the windowsill. So the idea here is that you have to have the app first. And then once you have the app on your phone, you create your Bitmoji to look like however you want it to look. Look at all these cool Bitmojis. And then what you'll do is you'll go to the extension, you'll pull up your Bitmoji, and this would allow you to add a Bitmoji of yourself to pretty much anywhere you want to on the web now on any document because you have it as an extension. So it's kind of a fun thing. So I'm going to delete myself from this particular thing, and for now I am going to sign off. This is Miss Augustine saying, talk to you soon.